Hi and welcome to my playhouse and today I'm gonna continue uh, a little project that I've been working on for quite a while and when you see the project which is right here on the table you will recognize that this is something that we have done multiple videos on and I tried to mount it in the data center using a magic arm like this and that was just wobbly as hell so I thought that I would not do that so I ordered a couple of mounting things in China and these were really well priced so I just got two um, I have one here I have oh, it doesn't look that great but and they were so cheap that I just ordered two just um, just to have two um, and it's just a little bracket like this and this is uh, the same mount as for a camera which is also the mount that is on the back of this thing let's just see the back it has one here and this unit over here also has one but I just want to mount it like that and put it in my data center up near the roof so something like that and uh, I'll mount it something something like this well kind of it has to point down so probably something like that so let's try let's try that out so out here in the data center I want it kind of in the middle of the racks not in the middle of the window but in the middle of the racks there is two racks here and if we draw a line it would be sitting something near there and pointing that way so I think that is what we're gonna try it's a uh, well it's really disgusting now I really should remove this thing around the windows but well I'll get to that I'm sure but I'll mount that um, thing there let's go see how that looks This little bracket can be taken apart just by unscrewing it far enough and then it this one is probably it's in there you can take it apart by loosening the screw but this one I can mount on the wall and then I can afterwards uh, mount the, the net box which also means that I can take it down from the wall which is a rather nice thing so um, that's not a bad idea Okay, I've marked the wall with three small spots and I'm gonna mount it like this because the drag will be downwards. The thing is a bit heavy, so I want two screws in the top of it, uh, making sure that it don't go down, and then just one screw in the bottom to, um, I don't know why it's there, but it's there. It comes with these small screws. I don't think they're gonna cut it. My wall is a piece of shit out there, so I definitely need something um, quite a bit longer than this. And I need to drill some holes and stuff, so that's not gonna cut it. Hmm. No. And there is some... I don't... Yeah. Oh. They might not be that bad, but... Well, I'm gonna see what I have. Okay, I don't usually come with a lot of disclaimers on what to do and what not to do, but this might be one of the things that you should really think about before you ever do this. Um, drilling holes in a wall in a data center could be the very last thing you do at that workplace uh, because the dust that is gonna come out of the wall and yeah, mostly the dust and also the drill it is not very cool in a data center. The dust might go into the server and you will see an increase in errors on the server. Also, it might set up the sprinkler system, the dust, because the, the sprinkler system might think that this is a fire and it will try and put that out. Not a good thing. And lastly, the, the drill that I'm using, don't plug that in next to the servers. Um, use another outlet for that kind of stuff but well as I usually say don't do what I do improve on what I do so 
Here we go. See if I can mount this thing. That would be nice. I think the screw has to be on this side, otherwise, it's not going to be able to. Hope it's good there. Well, that was just a little short video on me mounting this Netbot 500 wallbot thing. And uh, now I have to uh, draw some cables from the Netbot for power and for network. And um, around the back to the rack somewhere. And I don't think I want to do that today. It's rather hot outside, so I'd rather go do something else outside. So, but thank you very much for watching my videos. Do subscribe to my channel so that you can see me again when we connect this thing. And have a really nice day. Bye bye.